place is wonderful, isn't it? Allow me to introduce myself. I'm Bloomseer Poplar, soothsayer and healer of Oasis. It brings me great honor to welcome you. Be wary of the water in the caves. I fear they still carry the sting of radiation from the bombs. In what we call the harvest month, the Great One creates seeds among his branches within seed pods. At the end of this time, the pods open and the seeds are carried quite easily upon the wind. It's quite beautiful. Wherever the seeds take purchase, they grow into trees, plants, grass, or all manner of wonderful things. He's not my God. He's everyone's God. You, me, everyone. This place isn't meant just for the tree minders. It's for all mankind. Oh, if only Tree Father Birch saw it as you do. Of everyone, he's been here the longest. You'd think he'd realize that this place won't remain a secret forever. The caravans know about it, and you found it. How long before someone comes to take this place by force? No. I say allow this place to grow, and that issue becomes moot. My father was a healer like myself. He had the most curious books I would read about trees and plants and their medicinal properties. Many years later, I heard a rumor about a place such as this. I spent a decade in search of it. I've been in this wonderful place for over 15 years now. I was the third one to arrive here in Oasis. Tree Father Birch was a bit wary at first, but Leaf Mother Laurel convinced him to let me stay. If she hadn't been around, I doubt Birch would have ever let me stay here. After a while, they taught me their ways and together we developed the ceremony of purification that you undertook. Farewell, outsider. <laughs>